Today we're going to cover our new range of tight house air tightness tapes that can be used on wraps or even panelling systems. We've got an outdoor version of the tape that can be outside in the elements for around about four months. And then we've got an indoor tape which is white. To achieve tight building envelope, the combination of wraps and tapes is one of the uh, more common solutions. The application of the tape is critical to the success of um, creating an airtight envelope. In the market, there are a lot of um, different products coming from different brands performing a similar function, but they all have different level of um, difficulties in terms of application. And from our point of view, how easy to inspect and do quality control. And here is some benefit of the tight house tapes. There are a number of brands offering a whole range of different products in the market and they have very similar performance in most of the um, requirements on the matrix. But usually from our experience, three of the qualities can vary a lot between those um, different products on the market. They are the agility, the color of the product and also the cost. Color. I think a lot of you would think, why is color important? And here is a little demonstration we have here using a white tape from Tight House and a black tape from a different manufacturer. If you have a closer look at the tape, we deliberately apply it with some imperfection. And if you look closely, the white tape or the light color tape can easily show the imperfection by its shadow but if you're using a black or dark color tape it's really hard to try to pick up the issue from apart you almost need to get so close you sniffing the tape in order to pick up any imperfection or issue for a very tight requirement building such as passive house how easy you can pick up imperfection is critical because every single bit of this hose can add up to make or break your um, passive house requirement of 0.6 air change per hour. And the next, agility or flexibility of the substrate. Um, usually when people think about taping, we got a straight edge, very easy to apply. It doesn't really matter. But in reality, in a construction site, we got all kinds of different profiling happen because of the wrap is sitting on battens or other structural member. It creates all kinds of crease. And how flexible your tape is makes all the difference. If the substrate is very rigid, when you try to apply it, you have no chance to mold the tape around the different profile, which make it very difficult. And remember, in a real construction site, you're working on a stud wall, you don't have the backing of a cement sheet there. And when you apply, you can barely put any pressure on the membrane. And it makes it very difficult to go through any crease or any um, stretch that you have around those profiling. With a more flexible substrate and thinner substrate, you are a lot easier to just mold around and go along any profiling of the membrane. We've seen a lot of wrapping and tape product on the market, which cost a lot of money. Plus, not too many supplier would have sufficient training given to the tray how to apply it. And we've seen so many times the trays applying all these expensive products like sucking or even like hanging out their washings not taping it not stabilizing it properly and it all becomes a waste of money the tight house tape is a very different product to foil tape the performance is substantially different these sorts of tapes will not stand the test of time on the wraps on the inside or the outside of the building envelope and they should not ever be used moving forward with that with the application of these sorts of tapes which are designed for the building envelope for wraps or for panel systems it's super important that you completely push and we call dewater 
the tape so that it makes a spectacular adherence to the surface that you're sticking to. If you do not dewater the tape and you, you stick it down without actually pushing it down, the, the level of adherence that you're gonna get as well as the longevity of the tape sticking to that position is not gonna be there. It has to be, there has to be some force that enables the tape to make its connection to the material that you're sticking to. For more information and pricing for these products and other products, go to tighthouse.com.au.